What did I do in New Year? Oh, I can't remember. Mm. But it was must good. Must have been a good one. Well, it must have been. That's what they <laughs> yes, tell me. Yes, yeah. yes. Now, I want to talk to you about this whole sort of thing with oh. Novak Djokovic. I mean, you're, you're sort of shaking your head. What, what, do you, what do you make of all of this? Well, as for his mum complaining about the hotel, he should have tried to get into Britain, shouldn't he? And Dover, the beaches, it'd have been put up in a four or five star well, hotel. Well, they'd have picked him up, wouldn't they? Yeah, they'd have picked him up and he'd been sorted. <laughs> um, I think he's a moaning, spoiled brat. I think he's a brilliant sports person. Uh, you can't knock his record. But, look, the rules, as you said, should be the same for everyone. And I'm fed up of the elite, the establishment elite, you know, just running roughshod over the rules, whether it's people coming to cop, whatever it was called, cop out. And also, you know, people, you know... Top influences going to Dubai and places. It can't be right. It's got to be. It's got to be one rule for all. Um, and so I'm glad they're making an example of him. I love Australia. Do you, do you think they're making an example of him? I mean, as you said, it's he's, they're just treating him like everybody else. Yeah, and they're basically saying to him, "Look, he's not being held." All these people saying, "Oh, he's being held as a prisoner in a small room." No, he's not. He can go like that lady just said whenever he wants. And I tell you, just one little thing I want to say about this. I've been very surprised. Well, not surprised. It's kind of predictable. I'm a Brexiteer. I wanted Brexit. But I've been surprised how many leaders of the Brexit situation are saying, oh, it's disgusting what Australia are doing. Well, just run this one past... Nigel's done it. Nigel Farage. Just run it past me again, Nigel. Australia are protecting their borders. Isn't that what you're <laughs> calling for at Dover? I think it's well, a see, fair I point. didn't hear Nigel say that, so I can't vouch for him because I don't know. But, he did say it. But if he, you know, but if he absolutely said it, I mean, I, I look at this and I think, well, it's the same rule for everybody. Just yeah. because you know that Djokovic's worth how much billion or quarter of a billion. Yeah. Don't see why you should get past the no. rules. But let me oh. shake in his head. Let me... uh, no, no, I, I agree with you in one sense, but I have a slightly different view to John and maybe to you about what he did wrong. He bragged about it. He's worth 250 million euros or something like that. <laughs> and then he wants to tell everyone he dodged the rules. Yeah, that's, that's the mistake. Now, if Roger Federer had been in the same position, I don't know what his position on vaccinations is, but if he'd been in the same position and say he didn't want to be vaccinated, he'd have gone and said, look, it's like this. This is the exemption I'm applying for. Tell me what yeah. I need to do. And that when they came back and said, that's all right, I said, thanks very much. He'd have just shown up. No pomp, no circumstances. I don't think it would... I did it better than you. I don't think it would have made any difference with the Australians. I mean, <laughs> Australia is... I mean, you've seen those programmes, the Border Force shows. Yeah, but the, yeah. You ain't getting, you ain't getting past show. them. Okay. I love it. Not yeah. all of that is completely real. But, but the, the, the thing about what's real here is Novak isn't very clubbable. Roger Federer is very clubbable. You think he's huggable because he's so nice. And he yeah. looks and, great. I mean, yeah. not, not to say that that... But that can have a... That, that can have a... But then, yeah. again, but even it, if you look great or you've got money, you still it's should not be able to get past it. You play by the rules, Lembit. Oh, yeah, but okay, it's not. A, yeah, maybe so. But I'm talking about the the, the real politique here. He, maybe you don't think he looks great. It's how he behaves. He doesn't yeah, behave he great. He doesn't. Uh, he doesn't look clubbable. He looks angry, and he looks like I'm better than you. He looks smug. Yeah. Doesn't and he? basically, if if you look at the there are 24 pages of exemptions for this country. If you come in, if you claim you're going to create 500 jobs, you don't have to be vaccinated. If you're going to be here for maybe two or three days, you don't have to be vaccinated. But if you come in and say, hey, I beat the system, someone's going to call you but out he, on it. He sort um, of didn't say that, though. That's slightly unfair to him because he didn't sort of say that. No. He just got He just had a picture of him standing by his private jet or whatever it was, saying, oh, come on, you know, I'll be there. But when's however, the last time the you did that? that? When's the last time you were photographed oh, next to a private jet going to Australia? Just, oh, only yesterday. No, no, he, but, no but he, the, the that, he here, shouldn't have done that. Lembert is absolutely right. But I just think it's becoming a funny story now. I love the way the fact that on Twitter he's now called Novax. I think that's <laughs> really <laughs> funny. Yeah, it's Novax no now. <laughs> and, uh, it's no vax, no jab, no vax. <laughs> no no vax, not playing. I, I think it's brilliant. Uh, boot him out. I'm all for the Australians. We could do some real leadership like that. I know Scott Morrison is playing to the gallery. Do you think? I don't think he is. I think oh, he, he is. A no, bit. those are the rules, and he's sticking by them. He's okay. saying that just because you're so and so, you're not getting past. The problem is, yeah. it's slightly obscure. So two things. I have begun to get concerned about how much stuff we're putting into our bodies about about COVID. I'm beginning to wonder maybe Omicron's sorting it out the way we couldn't. Mm. Yeah, and that's obscured by what Novak's done. The second thing is, 5G actually is used as a weapon in some places. But because his mum tied this into Novak's bleating, that's being pushed to the side. When someone like Novak Djokovic, who's, as I said before, isn't very clubbable, isn't like lovable in, in, from a distance, says stuff like this, people just react just for the reason that John said, and you said, spoilt kid, 
gone bad. Yeah, and that's why I think but you're going kind quietly, of win your excuse. award and no, come out. I don't think you're so. No, no, I think, I think this, they've got rules. Apparently he was supposed to fill some forms, so we don't know the exact detail. But oh, come he, on. No, hang on, let me finish, let me finish, please. They, they, they don't know the exact detail, but he hasn't quite complied with their requirements. Sure. And if that is the case, whether he's Novak Djokovic or, or just you, Lembit. <laughs> only, <laughs> only you. Yeah, yeah. Only you. I wasn't going to win then, the Open. Then, I just wasn't going to win it. Well, then, you know, those are the rules. That's that's can we not miss the main point here as well? Novak is only one person in the sporting world who hasn't done this. Well, we've the got, second one, the lady who's just... Yeah, yeah, I know, but we've got international footballers and Premier League mm. players in this country who are refusing, and some of their wives or wags, whatever they call them, have been promoting anti-vax propaganda. Well, this is a bit like no this vax needs, partner, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. This does... Let me finish a little bit. These, this needs to be looking at, looked at. I don't see why you should have to have a vax to go and watch a football game when the overpaid uh, sports stars on the pitch don't have to. This is where we've lacked leadership, in my opinion, in this country. But that's why it gets really interesting, because actually, and I'm not sure, so this is not absolutely definite, but it looks like there could be an issue with vaccinations. And we, haven't well, got we don't know. Yeah. No, no, we I'm don't sorry. know it. But We're straying into you. territory, yeah, but, which you, we yeah. don't have any evidence. Well, yeah, but, but, but if there is any... He's there, now the cuckoo. Look, look, if, look what's happened. Yeah, but if there is any evidence, then, you know, obviously we would explore everything. Yeah, but Nana, yeah. John, but this we is, don't know John, that Nana, yet. John, and I think is, that you, you sort of, you're straying into something else. No, no, Nana, John, it's not. You didn't hear the rest of it. It looks like there may be an issue. But we can't get into that debate, as you've just proved. No, we can get into no, that debate. No, we can't get into the debate now we're, because we're talking about no vaccine. That's right, behavior, and also because not about the issue. No, and also because we're running to a break. Right. Oh, fair enough. <laughs> <That's my panel. laughs> great. great argument. Great argument. <laughs>